And that's why I love Storm Tornado. It was so freaking broken that it just cut through everything. Like, it would just cut through everything on the Like, cut through everything, so... I'd have nothing to worry about. Like, the big enemies was like, oh, well, this enemy's tough. I was like, oh, well, not anymore because Storm Tornado kills it. I hate these pets. <laughs> See, like, and that was another thing I hated. That was another thing I, I grew to hate about the Mega Man X games. Is the whole, is that you can actually do a command dash instead. Like, you can do a command dash by, like, tapping forward. But, what would end up happening? But, sometimes I would just end up accidentally tapping forward, and then making, like, a huge mistake, like I almost did. And dashing into something I have... It's like da either dashing into an enemy, or just dashing to my death. Oh my god, the heck, like, what, why is my dash jump not working? <laughs> like, when I need the dash jump, I, it's like, I don't get it. And then, there's that crap that happens, where I'm trying to stand on the platform. Ugh. Hey, yeah, this is like the last hardest thing in terms of platforming for Mega Man X. Well, for this game, it's just this section here. The rest of the game is like completely... The rest of the game is like straightforward. <laughs> I think they changed this in Maverick Hunter X because of how difficult it can be. Like, see, X isn't... <sighs> like, dude, like, what happened to dash jumping? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, I hate myself right now. <laughs> like, he won't... Like, he just refuses to dash jump for me. I don't know why. I don't know why it's a thing, either. Like, the game just doesn't want... Like, the game just doesn't want me to dash jump. But I do enjoy the music, at least. God, he won't, like, he literally will not dash jump. Which I hate. I, like, I hate it when the commands do not come out. Like, seriously, what the heck is... <sighs> like, the commands do not... Co the commands don't come out while I'm on those platforms. For whatever... Like, for whatever reason they can come up with. For whatever reason they could come up with, I can't sit, like, I just can't dash jump off this. <laughs> oh my 
God. Oh, now you dash. Like, now you dash. <laughs> what the heck? Which, I, I think that actually became... I think it actually... Be, thinking about it now, I think that actually became an option to where you could turn off by doing a command dash. But he's not... Like, he just doesn't want to jump. It's like my commands got locked up or something. I don't know. I knew, like, I, like, I knew that going into this, like, that, like, this crap was gonna happen where I wouldn't, where I would just literally be stuck at this part of the game. Again. Cause I remember I did a stream, like, years ago, and I was stuck because of this same issue where, like, X, like, for whatever reason, the game just, well, I think, oh, well, I'm not going to dash jump because that's too complicated of a move. And he's dead. <laughs> Hate it when I do that too. I think that's dead. <laughs> and I was like, why can't I do? I was in there like, well, why can't I not dance jump? <laughs> or just me choking at the game. The bad thing is that I need my rolling shield for the battle. And then, like, you can't afford to screw it up. Because it, it's very easy to just drop it. And I think that's why a lot of people just went for, you know, Zero's Buster. Because it's a lot easier. And this happens. Yep. Dang it. I don't think I'll be able to get it. Those first two are those first two are like essential, I believe, to actually getting up there. And you have to drop. <laughs> like you have to like drop just enough so that you can hit all the others. And I think I broke it to where I can't reach it now. Which I may have to end up like how many lives do I have? I don't have any lives though. <laughs> Well, well, there's an extra knife at the top and there's a dark tank. So I can go grab that and go and kill myself, I guess. And I refilled this one. So it's not a total loss. I always hated these guys because they, it's so, there's so many of them and they just keep tossing crap. And sometimes they'll, they'll even be like, that one that would just toss it from way off screen and it just dies super fast. Dang it! 
I was in there trying to prepare my jump and instead I just get knocked off by the metal. It's like you took damage, but you regained life instead of taking damage. <laughs> Yeah, my shots are too high enough. To, my, my shots are too high in order to actually. Yeah, see, this didn't exactly make much sense to me for X to more or less kick these <laughs> and get. It was like, and he can get, and he can break through those, but he can't break the ones over here. Like he can't break the ones over here as easy. <laughs> I'm guessing it's because his head is like a to make a permanent hitbox. So, let me get this guy to, like, get one of these guys to kill him by, like, just standing on him. Because of contact damage. Ah! <laughs> I think that was the only reason why I liked actually having the lava. Because it was a lot easier to deal with. Like, it's a lot easier to deal with having the lava around in trying, when it comes to trying to commit suicide. Well, hey, maybe I can fill up that second energy tank with no problem. Nope. Oh. I may need to cut this out when I. Edits. <laughs> like, like they have me sitting here like sucking all the time. It makes me think like how it makes me wonder like how bad <laughs> like Well, I remember the joke about people make like um and this is about the game like this is towards game grumps. No, this is about game girls. Like a lot of people make the comments about Aaron sucking at video games. I was just like, mm, I don't know. Like I don't, like I don't really know him that well. Like I only started watching him like a few years ago. Pretty much when um, Danny jumped in. When Danny like joined, because I never saw like anything before that. Because I didn't, well, I didn't really care. So I didn't really care to like watch commentary videos. Like, I, st I still don't really care to care watch commentary videos now. Damn. <laughs> I still don't care to watch commentary videos now, but I'm more... Wow, I jumped on it and... <laughs> and like, he just... I hate how fickle this one is. But I want the upgrade. And honestly, like when I think about when I think about the whole thing about Aaron sex in video games, like I think back to like one of the playthroughs that's memorable for me on Game Grumps is is a uh, Ninja Gaiden playthrough, which the NES Ninja Gaiden, which I went wow, like that was actually that's actually pretty darn skill, <laughs> at least compared like when I compared it myself, which is essentially something I do or. Like I'll say, like I say, a lot of people are a lot better than me at games because they, put, because well, I'm like, well, I can bear myself, and I'm like, well, there was no way I could do that. <laughs> and sat there, and I watched him like beat Ninja Gaiden, and I was like, wow, I, I couldn't even get past the uh, thing. I got, a, I think I only got to like the second or third stage in it, Ninja Gaiden before I'm like, you know what, I'm done. <laughs> Oh, come on, Dex, <laughs> you can get this! Uh, 
And I'm sitting there like, well, yeah, like there's times where Aaron does suck at video games, I guess. I guess. But, and it's generally, like, people will make that comment on the playthroughs that I don't really watch. I never really watched on Game Girls. Like, it was, from what I hear, and I got a lot of, and there was actually, there was actually a couple of comments about this when I uploaded my Sonic Adventure playthrough. <laughs> and people were like, oh my god, you are so much better than the Game Grumps at this. And I was like, wait, huh? Like, how badly did they do? And like, oh god, they did horrible. Like, you just gotta, like, you just have to see it for yourself. And then the other guy's like, no, dude, don't see it. It's horrible. Like, they're like, no, don't see it. It's a hor it's a horrible playthrough. And I'm just in, I'm sitting there kind of laughing because I'm sitting there laughing because I'm like, wow, like I guess that's a compliment that a lot of people I was like, like did people come from the Game Grumps channel just to watch me play through the game? <laughs> but the thing is that I don't think they're like there for skillful playthroughs. They're more there for just comedy or like a talk show podcast type deal. Hey, why can't I get, why can I not get this? And see, this is why I hate this is why I hated this one. And I think they actually made it easier in Maverick Hunter X to get. In Maverick Hunter X, it was, I mean, it was it was actually pretty simple, considering that, like they changed a lot of the physics and whatnot. In a lot of cases, Maverick Hunter X is a lot easy. is a lot easier than this one because a lot because a lot of things that they did or they forgot to do. Like the bosses are a lot easier because you can just because every time you hit the boss with a we whenever you hit the boss with a weakness, they actually get they'll actually do their silly stun animation and basically their invinci their invincibility frames during that time frame is like <laughs> is there. Is pretty much their entire animation of being hit with their weakness. So you could, so you would essentially be able to loop them. Which the hardest thing I would say on that game was, at least for me, was playing as Vile because he plays completely different. Dude, come on. <laughs> I almost want to like pause and like try and get this off screen, but I know like the minute I like hit pause, it's going to be like, oh well, I'm going like, oh well, I got this. I never it was like speaking of the game drops, I never watched um, I never watched the game drops playthrough uh, or well, the solo playthrough where Aaron plays through Mega Man X, which. A lot of people know him for a lot of people know Aaron uh, on Megman X because he did his sequelitis on Megman X. I, I, I think I watched it once, but I don't remember it. Like I don't remember it that well. I'm not saying that it's bad or anything. I just don't, like it just wasn't exactly that memorable. Ah. Oh, God. What's worse about this is that there's no, uh... There's no, there's no attack. They didn't make an attack that actually, like, deals with movement until, at, until X2. <laughs> like, they, they didn't make an attack that has, like, X's movement until, like, X2 and X3 and all that. Do it. <laughs> I'm sitting there like, why can I not make this jump? Oh, <laughs> and that'll happen. And then that'll happen again. Come on, oh, oh, come on, I am mashing! I am, okay, finally! So that took how long? 
<laughs> that's gonna be like the bulk. That's gonna be like the bulk of this playthrough. Is that the little section right there? The X Buster is like honestly, honestly, I don't know how people do it without the X Buster. Although I've seen playthroughs and speed runs where people did this without the X Buster. Well, the X Buster upgrade. But it was like I, I actually love this upgrade because I thought like, oh wow, this is cool. Like you shoot, he shoots, and like it creates a shield around him. Holy charge. <laughs> Wait, 